Hey, I've been thinking. Now that the Saints are a real organization, I feel like I should have a better understanding of, you know, all the basic skills involved in day-to-day -day operations. Uh, which means? I was hoping you could teach me to shoot. Oh, yeah, sure. Meet me at the old quarry. I set us up a kick-ass practice range. Hey! Wow, Eli, you set this range up yourself? Yep. I didn't have any clay pigeons, so I had to make do with what I could find. Nice. What weapons are you going to use? Oh, I'm more of a book learner. I've done some research already. I just wanted to watch you, ask questions, and take notes. That's not really how you learn to shoot. Hey, everybody learns differently. Now, the first thing I saw in my research was that stance is very important. Sure, you gotta have a stance. So what's a good stance? I mean, this? I can't describe it. I just do it. Watch. Yeah, I get it. Next, my research said keep your eyes open when you shoot? Sure. I like to pretend there's a little white dot or crosshairs on whatever I'm shooting at, and then just aim for it. Like this. Damn! Yeah, I get it. What about breath control? I read a lot about exhaling when you pull the trigger. Honest to God, Eli, in a big firefight, I pay no attention to how I'm breathing. I just, well, look. Oh, and my research said to squeeze the trigger instead of pulling it? What the fuck's the difference? There's just a feel to it. Look. a certain squeeze quality. Nice. Hey, what's up with those trucks? Looks like Marshall. Uh, we're probably near one of their black ops sites. Trespassers on Marshall land will be shot! Grab a gun. That's right, assholes. You're the training exercise. Hey, hey, I got one. Good job, man. Uh, see what I mean about the dot thing? Another to allow civilians hey, on Marshall land. Get out your fear game now. Doing great, Eli. Dance, dance. Ah. Woo! More trucks coming. Let's take them. Uh, this may be a bit much for a beginner. Get in the car. I'll do the covering fire from the uh, roof thing. Wait, that's not. Oh boy. Fuck! Get back here and face the music! You won't get away with our training secret. How do you aim like this? Yeah, you better run. Yeah, you're fair game now! Oh my god, there's so many of them. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Should have got the roof rack. Okay. 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 Shit, shit, shit. What am I doing? I'm gonna puke. Don't let them escape. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe a, a bit more hands-on learning than I was hoping for. Hey, no, you did great out there. I guess next time I'm in a tight spot like that idols party, I can slow them down. But I think I'll leave the car roof shit to you from now on. Hey, 
You busy? I need your help with something. It's really important. I'm here. What's up? We need to get over to FB's ASAP. They're re-releasing the Mecha Burger. The what? The toy. Don't you remember? It looks like a hamburger but turns into a robot. Limited edition re-release. Let's go. You know, I think I had a Mecha Burger way back when. Everybody had one the summer I was nine. It was the most popular kids' meal toy FB's ever produced. And you want to relive your childhood? <laughs> sure, no problem. Oh, shit. Do you think they're all here for the Mecha Burger? Doesn't matter if they are. We can just muscle up to the head of the line. Uh, yes, hi. May I please have a chicken brat box meal with a Mecha Burger toy? In purple if you have it. We're out of Mecha Burgers. Shit. Well, there's another FB's in Marina Del Lago. Let's try there. If the Marina's FB's is also out, the next closest is a Mercado. And there are two in the flats, but we should try Mercado first. Dude, why is it so important to get a new one of these? Oh, I didn't have an old one. I never got one when I was a kid. It came out when I was in foster care. So. Oh, right. Let's get you a fucking Mecha Burger. What the hell are the idols doing here? Being pretentious anarchists and getting in everybody's way? What else? Well, they're between me and my kid's toy, so let's fix that. That's the last of them. Let's get my Mega Burger. Hey, my friend here needs a chicken kid's meal with a Mega Burger toy. In purple. They're all gone. Those horrible people in pink stole the entire shipment. They said something about striking a blow against capitalistic materialism and soggy french fries. Fucking idols. They really are a bunch of thugs. Taking joy from children. Fuck children, they took joy from you! Buckle up! There they are, get them to pull over! Not sure whether to ram or shoot. Whatever, just don't blow up the delivery car. Ah. So cool you're doing this for me. Ah! I'm shooting back next time. Fuck off. Just don't destroy the Mecha Burgers. There. You are now the proud owner of 500 limited edition Mecha Burgers. Nah, I just want one. Maybe sometime you could help me bring the rest down to the county orphanage? Absolutely. I wonder if I still have that old Santa Claus costume somewhere. Doesn't that costume have a shirt? Not when I wear it, baby. I need a favor. 
can you drive me around and pretend to be my chauffeur this afternoon? Wait, you want me to drive one of you? I gotta be classy today. Now that I've got money, I'm gonna buy some art from the kind of collectors who have chauffeurs. Come pick me up at the museum. I've been doing some research so I can blow them away. Be right there. So, what are we buying? Three Noshoni Fisher pieces. She's my hero. She made these amazing whimsical sculptures, sheet metal welded over steel frames. I promised myself that if I ever had money, I'd buy some of her work. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now keep quiet. I'm gonna call the first collector. Good afternoon. I was told you're the owner of a Nishoni Fisher original. Surprise. Huh? It's a big metal apple with a rattlesnake coming out of it. Ah, uh, that piece of junk. Well, I'm a huge fan of the artist and it can make you a very attractive offer. Ah, <laughs> there is no amount of money in the world you could offer me for that. <laughs> My ex-husband bought it as an investment, and it drives him nuts that I got it in the divorce. You cannot buy that kind of spite. <laughs> but... She hung up on me. Well, we could just take it. I don't want to take it. I want to buy it. This is my chance to be part of the art world. Legit. Look, if she didn't want to sell it because she actually loved it, it'd be one thing. But she doesn't even like it. You do. Why should she get to keep it despite you? I mean, I guess art is meant to be appreciated. Okay, let's get it. That won't fit in the trunk. We're gonna have to tow it. Ah, it is made out of steel. Just drive careful, okay? This is not how I expected my first big art purchase to go. Let's get the next one. And this time, we'll do it right. Yes? Hi, I understand you're the owner of a Nishoni Fisher piece? Music of the Desert. The cactus statue. Yes. Well, like yourself, I am a collector of fine art, and I would like to buy the piece from you. I'm prepared to pay what it's worth. Oh, I don't need the money, hon. I I'm sure you don't, but... But I do need the cactus. Oh, it makes a great place to hang the kids' swimsuits on summer days. Uh, sorry. What the fuck? She's gonna rust out the frame hanging wet shit on you. That's not how you treat art. So, we'll be taking this one as well? <sighs> Looks like.
It's all rusted out, just like I thought. I'll need to be extra careful driving or it'll fall apart. I guess not everybody actually appreciates art, even in the art world. One to go. This time, we do it right for sure. Heidi, Heidi. Yes, hello. I understand you're the owner of a Nishoni Fisher piece, Moon River. It's a cow. Wait, what? That thing? Oh my god. Me and my sorority sisters stole it from outside the Santo Aliso Community Center in college. I was so drunk, I threw up on it. Ugh. Oh, fuck it. We're stealing this one, too. This piece is really fragile. Try not to destroy it on the way home, okay? I can pound the dents out. We interrupt your broadcast with this breaking news. The art thieves terrorizing Monte Vista have been spotted fleeing the area with a large metal cow in tow. Okay. Good news? You're part of the art world. Bad news? As art thieves. Fuck that. We are art liberators. Now drive. survives whatever they did to it. It'll survive the drive home. Look, Nina! Pig's chasing a cow! Get it? Surrender! This cow handles like shit. No worries. I'll just weld some patches on it. Cover me! Oof. They're not chasing us anymore. Must not want a war with the Saints over some asshole's cow.
I'm really sorry that didn't go down the way you wanted. Nah, those people weren't really art collectors. They were just assholes. I'll make it into the art world for real soon enough. At least I've got the Fisher pieces I always wanted. And I'm gonna treat them right. I mean, once I repair all the damage, we did liberating them. Hey, did you bring the packages in? What packages? The ones by the front door. Shit, I think someone stole them. Oh, fuck no, I'll be right there. Kevin, run me through what happened. I got a delivery notification text with a picture of some packages by the door, but by the time I went to get them, they were gone. The mail carrier can't have gotten far. Let's track them down and see what happened. Can I help you? You just delivered packages to the old mission church. What happened to them? One of your people took them. Some fella wearing pink. Pink? It's the fucking idols. They stole our shit. Which way did they go? They ran off over there. What the hell did we order anyway? Maybe it's my Crucifix workout DVD? I want to get me some Jesus abs. I hate workout fads. Hey, fuckers, give us back our boxes. Get our boxes now, asshole! Boxes full of knives. Oh, right. It's the knives Nina and I ordered off that infomercial. I hope the number of knives isn't a measure of how upset you were. What? No. The guy on TV was just a really good salesman. Come to think of it, there should be way more boxes than this. They might be nearby. Let's check the alley. Where the hell are my boxes? Fuck you, boxes! Where are my FBs? I've been waiting for you assholes to bring me my nugs! Why don't we check the FBs? Nugs do sound good. So, uh, why'd you buy so many knives? I mean, this seems a bit excessive. Nah, eh, retail therapy. You look for something to make you feel better, one knife leads to another, and boom! You got like a billion knives! Fuck. I'm... I'm sorry I made you guys so mad. I, I didn't mean to... Whoa, whoa, Kev, we were never mad at you. We were just upset about the situation. Also, we really like knives. We even got you. Let's go. Yeah, we're still missing some. Seriously? I guess there's an idol's hangout we can check out. Night work. You don't want to miss this. This is getting out of hand. Good night, 
That's all the knives we ordered. Look, Kev, that one's for you. Oh my god, is that an Oni chef's knife? You guys are the best. <laughs> hey, our crew just finished a job. You wanna go with me to get our cut? Sure, meet you at the church. One of our crews just pulled off an armored truck heist. They're splitting up the cash. Stealing insured money, my favorite victimless crime. Let's go get our piece. our own heist to pay rent. Yeah, feels like it was last week. Seems like cheating. Our crew does all the work and we sit back and collect money. Who trained the crew? We did. And who has the crew's back if they screw up? We do. Exactly. We earn the right to sit back and collect money. Yeah, you're right. I guess we've hit the big time. There they are. Stolen armored truck and busted it open? Good job. Thanks. Your training video on the weak points of different models really helped. Well, preparation is the key. Eli taught me that. Mike the Prince yet? Twice. You can spray it with air freshener, just in case they bring it off. I like the thoroughness. Got the money divided and bagged up. Here's your share. The cops found us. Fight as a team. What 
the hell? Did they send the entire precinct? This is a lot of heat for one armored car. something. Show them how the saints do it. We need to get the crew out of here. We'll draw the cops after us. The rest of you scatter. Nina, grab that armored truck. Nice. That should keep their attention on us. I work. Down and out. Boss, everyone got away safe. No one got caught. Awesome. Nina, time to lose him. Police 
Police Chief Michaels is coming to us live outside the Santo Ileso Police Station. I'll make this quick. The Santo Ileso PD has identified a new menace plaguing the streets of our city, known as... Holy oh, shit! That's us! The Shirt Mafia. What? That's not our name! As of today, they are public enemy number one, which is why I'm creating a special task force to bring these criminals to heel. A task force? Holy shit! We really have hit the big time! Uh, you do realize this is gonna be a huge problem, right? Nah, they can't even get our name right. How much trouble can they be? We'll see. Thank <laughs> you.